going to do a quick video on listening for a blown head gasket through the uh, coolant reservoir. So I found one, thought you might want to hear what it sounds like. So we're just going to have the spark plug out and the ignition coil and get our, if you just got shop air, you don't even need this. I just like to have percentages, but just need shop air directly into the hole. Just take your hose, you know, you got to make sure it it's open-ended. It can't be uh, like a compression gauge hose. Thread it in there. All right, shop air is hooked up. Get your gauge set to zero and hook these guys up. I got it hooked up. We got pressure building. So it looks like there's not a lot of leakage, but let's listen. Can you hear that gurgling? Watch this. You hear that? Gurgle, gurgle. See the steam coming out? Yep. So when you hook this up, it doesn't even matter what top dead center is on the cylinder. Just throw it in there, compress it with air, and it'll eventually fill up the entire cylinder with air. You know, either it's going to leak or it's not. So, anyway, that's the one as far as verifying through the uh, through the coolant reservoir or through the coolant housing that you got a blown head gasket because the air leaking through that cylinder should not go into your coolant unless the head gasket's blown. Hope I helped you out. Thanks.